But when I when I wake up, I I know that I need I need to spend that first twenty minutes, half an hour, forty minutes with before God, with God before God, uh, knowing that I there is a restlessness within me which which only finds rest with with God, and if I can do that, that gives me space. That gives me joy, that gives me the light that's necessary to go out and work and be with those people within my community, within the school. Liturgy, good. Going to church. I'm going to church right on a Sunday. Good. The building itself. Exactly. Thank you so much. Ecclesiology is the study of this. I'm trying to involve them and make them aware of, of how much God loves, really truly loves them. I do want to impart that profound sense that they are loved very profoundly and very deeply at the very core of who they are. A life lived in prayer itself is a wonderful example. Being around these kids is a real privilege because in some small way you're part of their growth, part of their, their it's, a, it's a nurturing role, I think. You know, it's a role where you, you're there, in some level imparting knowledge, information, uh, in some way asking them to engage with the world around them, but probably more than that, just to be a, just to be a loving presence. I found that Augustine, fell in deeply in, in love with God and that same experience has happened to me this falling in love with God to fall in love with God is the greatest romance to seek him the greatest adventure to find him the greatest human achievement <laughs>